in it. Hey everybody, gonna do a quick video on my EDC backpack. I just got this backpack, I'm pretty happy with it. For starters, where you can run your uh, headphones for like a MP3 player or an iPod. Um, I ran some gloves so I can just pull them out real quick. Got some chest seals here. Got some, got the gray pack, I don't know what those are called, but then I got the halos, I'm more familiar with those. Got some large bo uh, wound bandages, <laughs> excuse me. Wound, uh, wound bandages, uh, got three of them, got an H bandage, got some uh, shears, got two SOF uh, first gen tourniquets, in every little compartment I have uh, gloves. These are, I don't know what name of these gloves are, but they're like seven, seven or eight mils thick, they're nice and thick so they don't rip super easy. In this pack, in this little compartment, I have more or less the boo-boo stuff like Neosporin, uh, little pieces of God's band-aids, iodine wipes, and uh, some eye wash. I have a seatbelt cutter on the side. It's usually winched down pretty tight when it's all packed together. It's a Gerber. I have a, quite a few of these. I have them in almost all the trucks. I have no favoritism. I just find them used all the time for cheap. And on the inside of here, I have some life boat rations, high calories, and I got a couple bottles of this. Excuse me, a couple bottles of Propel. You know, this isn't like a survival backpack or nothing. But if I break down, I always have water, not so much food. So that's why I have the life boat rations a little bit. I have four bottles of water in here. Oh, kiwi strawberry, my favorite, my favorite flavor. There's a side compartment right here. What I really like about this backpack, I don't know anything about backpacks. It was, it was quality. It was a good price, so I went with it. It's yellow on the inside, so you can identify stuff. In this compartment, I have two Glock 17 mags, a backup Glock 30. Excuse me, 43 mag. And if I'm not carrying my backup gun, it'll be in there. Usually it's a J frame, a Smith and Wesson 442, or a Glock 43. Done a video on this Glock so far. Let's see if I can multitask this motherfucker out here. So, got that bitch off. my backup gum, the backup gun, not gum, um, backup light, serum like TAC Pro 2, double A. Right here I keep on the outside, kind of smushed in here is another pair of shears, kind of seatbelt or whatever, in case this gets lost or dropped or something. Um, but everything's loaded. Oh, fuck me. This nose a crack. Oh well. It's nothing crazy. And SR Tactical has a great uh, warranty. They're good people. I'll message them and uh, they'll probably resend me a holster. Me and a make carrier. Awesome people though. I've had this for probably two years now. Excuse me, I take that back. Probably two and a half. It's, uh, I've had this since my original C6 holster. But that's my EDC. I have this, uh, Piece of shit magnet light. But that's my EDC backpack. This is what I keep in my truck. So uh, thanks for watching.